It's so nice to see you. Thank you. Yeah. Me too. We've been doing so much of this planning and all of that for I know. so long now. And here you are. It's nine months. It is. Yes. It is. Yes. Since, yes. since we met in Bangalore. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, before we start talking about the other things too, um, just to know a little more about you. Yes. The person. So, initially, uh, when did you do your training? Then, you know, what was the uh, original training in? And um, then from there, how did psychodrama become a part of your life and your profession? Yes. You know, so. um, well, I was starting to do teacher training when I discovered uh, psychodrama. Is it? So, I was training mm. in early childhood education and uh, with autistic children, deaf children, mm -hmm. uh, migrant families. So I was training in all of those okay. uh, areas, I suppose you'd say. Um, I was also doing public speaking and I uh, um, had a lovely group of women back in the 70s, this is, oh. around 1975. and. Uh, I uh, became um, a public speaker wow. around then. But at the same time, 19, in the 70s, everything was possible mm. uh, in Australia and uh, in America. I think in the 60s, you know, there was the hippie movement and all of that. And so there was a lot of new ideas and new choices and new groups developing. Yes. Um, and I was involved in a lot of them, training in a lot of them. Lovely. Just like in India now, everyone's doing lots and lots, lots of things. And lots of, yeah, it's 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 yeah, it's just a uh, high, yeah, 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 yeah. It's very exciting time. Yes, it yes. is absolutely. Yes. So these were very exciting times. I was doing tea groups. Um, they came from Esalon, you know, in Gestalt. Mm. Uh, transactional analysis. I was doing lovely. Five years of that. Five years of Gestalt. Uh, transpersonal uh, psychology and transpersonal workshops uh, which were originated by Stanislav Grof. Yes, yes, yes. Eric Byrne, um, TA, all of that. And uh, neuro-linguistic programming mm. with Bandler and Grinder. They were the people who wrote a lot about yes. that modality. And so it was really exciting and then um, one of my Gestalt teachers said to me mm -hmm. that they thought that I could do psychodrama. He yes. they thought, this, I think this psychodrama will be a really good method for you. It had just come into Australia in 1974. Someone had been over to America. Okay. A woman by the name of Heather McLean. Okay. And she was a, um, an occupational therapist mm. and she was over in America she brought it back into Australia. So around 1974 is the first time that psychodrama came into Australia? Well it's probably a little bit earlier probably the late 60s early 70s she brought it in Okay. and then another person from Western Australia uh, Lynette Clayton and mm. her husband mm. went over to America to study it and uh, Lynette studied at St Elizabeth's Hospital where they had a small psychodrama stage in the hospital. Oh wow. And that uh, St Elizabeth's Hospital only closed a few years ago and it always still had a psychodrama at mm. department. Fantastic. So it makes me a little curious. So there in the hospital they actually had a stage yeah. for psychodrama? Small stage. Very small stage like you know. So big. Mm. Um, there is an original psychodrama stage which is huge is it? and it's round and okay. it's got several levels like two or three steps up and you sit on the bottom step and you're in a certain world you go up a step and start to get deeper into what are you talking wow. about and then you go onto the stage and that's where the surplus right, reality all cool. happens <laughs> anything can happen on the stage yes. So this was around 1977 mm -hmm. and I did my first workshop in okay. psychodrama, seven day one. Mm -hmm. So you went to the US to train or you no, trained uh, in Australia? In Australia, in, uh, in New South Wales, in Australia, did a seven day workshop and I loved it so much. I then did the second level, which was the second week. So I ended up doing two weeks residential of psychodrama. 
and loved it. And that that was it really. I'd fallen I'd fallen in love with it. It wasn't just <laughs> love that I'd fallen in love with it and yeah. I knew it suited my personality. Yeah. And I knew it was a big enough method that you could use in many, many areas of life and arenas in education, yes. with children, yes. adolescence, and drug and alcohol, uh, in hospitals, sanitariums, with yeah. people who were very ill, mm. mentally very ill, mm -hmm. but also can be used in prisons, in the cr criminal systems, with judges, police, as it was in America. It was? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Very widely used, huh? Yeah, very widely mm. used. So I just then focused on that while I was doing a whole lot of other training as a teacher and then training. I decided to, I wanted to be a psychotherapist. Mm -hmm. So I then did psychology and philosophy at Melbourne University. And so, you know, my degrees, my training has been based really on what I need to do rather than... Uh what people do <laughs> yes yes and and it's it's so amazing to see that psychodrama brought you to training for psychotherapy yes it is not the other way around no. that you learn to be a therapist and then out of the different modalities this is one of the things you learn it's the That's reverse right. thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and i'm so glad your gestalt teacher picked that up yes and pointed it out to you yes yes it was wonderful yeah. i mean sad for him <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but a very big uh, boon to the psychodrama world, I guess. Yes. yes. So I'm one of the earliest pioneers in Australia. Yes. Uh, there are many, many people who have disseminated it and taught it in Australia and New Zealand. Uh, but uh, it, it's, it's really early beginnings was definitely in the 70s mm. and then it sort of changed a little bit in the 80s and it got more uh, a curriculum more yeah. of a curriculum Organized. going and ethics yeah. and Structure. associations and all of that kind yeah. of thing yeah.